What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to another draw preview. And we have the Palmer Open this week, which is a brand new tournament for the WTA. So we've got no defending champions and we have some big names playing, some really big names playing, but some big names are also withdrawn. So let's go to the withdrawal list. So a lot of big names are pulled out of this one. We have Andrescu, She's Out, Wiskova, Cornet, Keys, Kudamatova, Pagula, Risk, Teichman, and Yastremska is also out of this one. So starting at the top of the draw, we have eight seeds in this one and nobody gets a buy in the first round. And look at that, Serena Williams. She is playing as a wild card in this one. She takes the top seed. She gets a qualifier in the first round. Winner of that will take on the winner of Sidney Akova and Towson in the second round. Then we have Rus versus Golubic. Winner of that's going to take on a qualifier or the number eight seed Garcia in the second round. Then we've got the number three seed Coco Goff taking on Kanepi in the first round. Winner of that's going to take on the winner of Georgie and Mikhail in the second round. Then we have a qualifier versus another Williams sister, Venus Williams. Winner of that's going to take on either Paulini or the number five seed, Anissa Mova. So obviously, we're going to be watching out for Serena in this one. She didn't do great in Rome last week, losing in her first match. So she's in need of a little bit of form. But also keep an eye on Goff, who did really well last week in Rome. And also Anissa Mova. Don't forget that she made a semi-final of the French Open back in 2019. So they're the players I'm watching out for this week. Bottom half of the draw now, we've got the number seven seed, Tormo. She takes on Pera in the first round. Winner of that's going to take on either Bogdan or the wildcard Arani in the second round. Then we've got a qualifier versus Sloane Stevens. Winner of that's going to take on either Shea or the number four seed, Kazakina in the second round. Then we have the number six seed, Wong versus Doi in the first round. Winner of that's going to take on either a qualifier or Habino in the second round. Then we have the wild card from Italy, Monticone taking on a qualifier. Winner of that's going to take on either Gracheva or the number two seed, Martic in the second round. So some players to watch out for in this one. Very interested to see how Martic does this week, the number two seed. Had a great week last week, making the semifinals of Rome. And also Tormo, interested to see how she does. She's had a great couple of months in Korea, best form at the moment. And also keep an eye on Sloane Stevens, Grand Slam champion, French Open former finalist. If she can put some matches together, maybe she can do some damage this week. So there it is, a stacked event for the WTA at the Palmer Open. Let me know down in the comments below, who do you think is going to win this one? It's very wide open, even though we've got some big names like Serena, you've got Martich down the bottom. Let me know down in the comments below, who do you think is going to win this this one. So having a look at the draw here, it doesn't seem as obvious as maybe you would expect, but I'm going to go with Martic to win this one. I think she had a great week last week. She's a very good clay court player, and I think she might have a little bit of an easier draw than someone like Serena up the top of the draw. So I'm going to go with Martic to win this one. So let me know down in the comments below, who are you picking to win this one? So Serena Williams, she's back this week in Palmer. Can she get some wins before the French Open? 